everybody wants to be a beast until it's time to do what beasts do. I never looked at things as problems. I look at them as opportunities. Who teaches you to be a man? Greatness is not something that you meet once. It's something that you meet thousands of times in your life and you don't reach it if you're not constantly in constant pursuit of greatness. The most powerful thing that we can be is ourselves. Dreams without goals are just dreams and ultimately they fuel disappointment. Those times when you don't feel like working, but you do it anyway. That's the dream. It's not the destination, it's the journey. Without commitment, you'll never start. But more importantly, without consistency, you'll never finish. You can't just say you want it. You can't watch the video and say, I want it as bad as I want to breathe. It's cute to say it. But when it's showtime, when the sun comes up, now it's time to hunt. And what separates you from everybody else is that when it's time to hunt, you're ready to hunt. It's a lifestyle. You don't hit the snooze button. You don't want to go run, you go run. You don't want to go swim, you go swim. You don't want to make your bed, you make your bed. You don't want to clean your house, you clean your house. You don't want to study, you study. That's how you start to callous your mind. So that became my life. When you can't control what's happening to you, control how you respond to it. That's where your power is. If you stay in your comfort zone, that's where you will fail. Success is not a comfortable procedure. If you think the price of winning is too high, wait till you get the bill from regret. Not only do I want to be a beast, if you follow my 24 hours, I do what beasts do. I know the feeling. No, this is not that fake lion, tigers, and bears motivation. This is that growing up in the slums, watching your mom nod on the couch as you go to school. We want more. We want more out of this life. And if you're not willing to give that to us, we're going to take it. To have an underdog mentality like everybody's already counted you out like everybody's already told you you don't have what it takes you don't measure up that what you started you will not finish claw your way into your future fight for your goal give it everything you have because you have nothing to lose life's gonna hit you in your mouth and you gotta do me a huge favor your why has to be greater than that knocked out and i love it buster douglas got knocked out nobody ever got knocked out by mike tyson and ever got back up it was almost a 10 count he was stumbling they were four three two one and ding 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 saved by the bell he goes to his corner the whole world is like up oh, that's it once he comes back out, that's it. Mike's gonna just keep hammering. And exactly that, Mike Tyson came out like, I got him. I got this kid up against the rope. Listen to me, many of you right now, life's got you up against the rope. You can't give up, you can't give in. Listen to me, if it was easy, everybody would do it. And if life's got you backed up, I need you to do what Buster Douglas did. Buster Douglas start fighting back. What an uppercut by Douglas, and down goes Tyson. The world was shot. <gasps> Goliath has been knocked down. What happened? And they went to Buster Douglas and they asked Buster Douglas simply like, what happened? And Buster Douglas said, listen to me, it's real simple. Before my mother died, she told the whole world that I was going to be Mike Tyson. And two days before the fight, my mother died. Buster Douglas had, he had a decision to make. When his mother died, he could die with his mother, or he made a decision, I can wake up and I can live for mom. And he knocked Mike Tyson out simply because his why was greater than that punch. His why was greater than defeat. His why was greater than his trial and his tribulation. And I'm telling you, if you don't know what your why is, and your why isn't strong, you're gonna get knocked out every single day. A man is not a man by his age. A man is a man by his experiences. What he goes through. What he fights through. That's what makes a warrior. That's what makes the greatest of all time. I will end my life in a bottomless pit. I'm gonna rise 
and I'm gonna show a world that greatness is obtained by the man that never stopped pushing. I believe, and I stand on it to this day, as long as the sun is shining on my face and not on my grave, I got an opportunity of a lifetime. Sometimes I gotta look myself in the mirror and ask myself, is that all you got? Come on, you're prepared, you're conditioned, you've been beaten, you've been battered, you've been broken, you've been left for dead, but there's more, because you're breathing and you feel it. So if you can feel it, you can push it, so push past. The truth of the matter is, that's not all you have. There's more left in you. I know you're tired. I know you're weary. I know you've been brought to tears. All the blood, all the sweat, all the sacrifice, all of the suffering. I know you want to quit right now, but this is not the time to let go. This is not the time to doubt. This is not the time to quit. Keep going. Use it to your advantage.